Today we're going to talk about the Tesla semi-truck that was announced a few months ago and what it means to the UK. Don't forget to subscribe for the latest trucking news, reviews, advice and insight into trucking life. I have a great interest and I'm super excited about trucking technology, the advances that are being made in alternative fuels. So I've been following the Tesla semi-truck progress quite closely and just want to bring you some news on what it means to the UK. So a little bit of backstory. Uh, if you're not up to date with this story, a few months ago uh, Tesla announced that they were going to be making electric trucks and going by their success and reputation in the car industry they're known for making some pretty special vehicles. Just to go over some of the specs of the new Tesla truck that was announced uh, it's going to have a 0-60 time of 5 seconds, that's unladen, and it's going to have a 0-60 time fully laden of 36 tonnes of 20 seconds. It's going to have a 500 mile range and could be recharged 80% in 30 minutes. Fuel costs are also uh, going to be cut by up to 50%. The new Tesla truck has a central seating position. Uh, and you're going to be flanked by two quite large screens uh, that are going to act as the truck's mirrors, sat-nav and vehicle computer controls. Some really big claims there made by Tesla and it's definitely going to be a game changer if they can see these through. So over in the States, it's estimated that Tesla have received pre-orders of at least 1,200 units. We have orders coming from uh, Walmart, PepsiCo, UPS and DHL and they have a production date of 2019, so this is quite real. A prototype has also been spotted cruising the streets of California, assumably testing, I think it's been going uh, from their research facility down to their factory. So what does this mean for the UK? Well, we can reveal that pre-orders have been opened in three European countries, that being Norway, the Netherlands and the UK. So Tesla won't say how many orders have been placed but we do know that uh, a Dutch operator called Breitner have placed an order along with Lithuanian firm Groteka Logistics. Norway's postal firm Posten Norgen are going to trial a unit whilst wholesaler Asco have reported to have ordered 10 units. So What's going on in the UK and what do we know when it comes to Tesla trucks? Well, we know that Bibby Distribution and rental company Franklin uh, UK are watching Tesla closely and they believe that the signs are positive and the electric truck could be a serious contender for their companies. So, if you are considering a Tesla Semi, you can now put a deposit down today and that will set you back £15,000. And a base spec 300 mile range truck will cost you £110,000. Or you can buy the 500 mile range truck for £140,000. Then there is also the option of the Founders series trucks, which is a top spec truck, and that will cost £150,000. So all in all, not that far off a top spec Scania then. Well, hope you found this interesting. I'll be keeping an eye out for any updates. We know that we've got, Volvo has recently released some very interesting videos on their YouTube channel. Uh, I'll put a link in the description for that. And Scania are also doing some really good things with their platooning, and it'll be interesting to see how that's gonna progress. So to keep up with updates with truck technology, where we're going with this Tesla, and how Volvo and Scania are progressing. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss a thing and I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Cheers guys!